Hola, amigos! Welcome back to Metal Gear Rising Revengeance. I'm gonna never try and speak that language again, because my British accent makes it sound like I'm trying too hard, which I am. So, we're just gonna go over here and collect this here VR mission, because that's what we like to do. I don't know how many of these things I've missed. Probably a bunch. Which one's that? Nine? I don't know. I, I imagine I've missed some somewhere down the line. Oh, hang on. Oh, was that? Oh, that is a nano repair paste thing. I don't need it because I'm full of health anyway. But still, it is nice to know that's there. So we're going to be raiding this building. And this building consists of not much. Oh, except these guys. You know, the usual shit that we're used to at this point. But hopefully... The fights with these guys won't take too long. Because there's two of them, though, I'm, I'm going to have to kind of watch my back a bit. Oh, and there's mini geckos. Oh, great. I forgot about these guys. Hang on. Let me do a sweep of the area. I really like Mistral's weapon for that ability alone, just to be able to do a big kind of area of effect. Oh, my God. Where am I even slicing? I don't know. But there we go anyway. Oh, okay. So, ow. I just got kicked! It's not even fair. Ah, oh, man. That one literally knocked me out there. Whoop! Come on now. Be nice. Play nice there. Let me just attack you a bunch of times. Ow. Oh my god. I was always terrible at fighting these guys because it's such a confined space. It's not fun. There we go. And every time I get a good goddamn parry on them, they always jump away. I know that's what they're programmed to do, but goddamn it, it's annoying. Which, you know, may have been the original reason it was done, but whatever. Okay. Big geckos are done. Mini geckos need to die now. Actually, they needed to have died a week ago. I'm doing really well with my jokes and sayings today, I swear to God. I've probably destroyed most of the furniture in this room, though. So there's something. Where are you? Oh, there you are. There we go. And that was pathetic. I'll be very lucky if I get, like, a B. Oh, wow. Actually, that wasn't as bad as I thought. Okay, well, either way. I'm still thinking that was pathetic. That was kind of shit. Right. You will find an elevator inside that office. Use it to reach the roof. Traveling atop buildings will minimize enemy encounters. That's over to our right, but over to our left is something way more important. Like, way more important. Oh my god! Dun dun dun! Oh man, what am I going to do with this guy? Let's just... Slice, 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 slice. Am I mean? Am I am I a bad person? I don't know. And there's his head, and there's his other part, and there's his everything, and now we can make a, a nice dinner. A nice, chunky meat dinner of some kind, because, you know... Raiden likes to eat his prey, apparently. Is that what I'm going for? I don't know. This guy has a rocket. These guys have rocket launchers, and I don't like that, so I'm going to get rid of those. And I apparently cannot switch the camera around a bit. Some people have had camera issues in this game, which is a, is a shame. I've not really noticed it myself as much. Oh, hang on. That guy's got an arm I want. No, no, no. I don't want to be him. I just want to arm. Thank you. Now I'll be. Jeez. The game thinks it has priority. Hey, hey, hey. Did I tell you you could pick up your shield again? Oh. Oh, look at you. Oh, fancy. No, 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 no. I don't think so, son. You ain't getting no shielding from this. Maliachi riding is overpowered. You don't even know the true power of the mariachi. Woo! Slice! 
<laughs> have way too much fun when it comes to doing that. Is that a rated battle? I think it is. Yeah, there we go. And I got no damage! Hey! S rank! Nice! Alright. I did not expect to get no damage on that. I thought I did get hit. Second floor, menswear. What's your status? I am reviewing the pre-flight checklist now. I have hired contractors to handle shipping the brain units. We should be airborne in just a few minutes. You sure you can pilot that chopper by yourself? Right, and of course. Need I remind you that we live in the golden age of unmanned flight? Even manned helicopters possess a robust semi-automatic mode. It is simple, really. So simple that I can continue to monitor your status and world marshal security from the pilot seat. I must say, for the world's largest PMC, their security procedures are quite poor. Quite poor. Sadly, I did not have the necessary permissions to override their plans. Nevertheless, the data I did find should prove most useful. So please, do feel free to contact me whenever you like. Appreciate it, Doc. Well, it's not every day one has the chance to collect so many brains. Think of the data. The research. Oh, and of course, your personal safety was a concern as well. Oh yeah, naturally, of course my personal safety was a concern. Jeez. I, I am basically second banana in this, I imagine. Okay, what can I see up here? There's a, a goodie box over there. Let's go and get that. I don't remember what it is. Whoa, almost fell off. <laughs> oh man, it was uh, BP. Ooh, that's not bad actually. Up, oh. so we gotta run up here, and uh, that wasn't quite what I was meant to do. So there you go. That that was a mission failure. You know, because I'm a cyborg which can take missiles to the face, giant metal gears, but I cannot. Do a simple fall like that because that would be, you know, weird, I guess. Oh, but we did miss the drum can last time, so I guess it was worth it after all. That, no, hang on, hang on, no, 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 no. That was almost another fall, but I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't. Fence, get out of my way! God damn it. Okay, well, I was going to try and sneak up on these guys, but apparently Fence didn't want me to. Oh, no, wait, you are one of the guys that needs a bit of beating first. Nope. Okay, so does this guy have a... Oh, no, I didn't mean to go in on that guy. I know, I think one of them has an arm. I don't remember, though. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure one of them did. I think I got hit though, so that's a bonus gone. Oh no, there goes his foot. You have an arm? You don't. Okay. Well, you don't have a spine either. So there you go. Where'd the other guy go? Wasn't there another guy? Oh, you have the arm! Well, had the arm, because apparently he just instant exploded. That was a bit weird. Where'd the other guy go? I swear there was another guy. Did I accidentally kill him somehow? I don't know. That is really weird. Whatever though. Gonna continue looking around. I don't... What is this? Is this a... Nano paste one? Yeah, it's a repair nano paste. Like every time I think I can use one of my nano pastes to refuel and then get another one, it's usually electrolytes. And I regret everything. Hey -oh! Okay, so to get this box over here, we need to jump over the top because we can't just slice our way through one of these fences. It's not the way that this game works. And that is nano paste again. So I'm assuming they're expecting us to get damaged at some point pretty badly. Okay, so over here is the start of one of the harder enemies, the Hammer User. The Hammer User can be a bit of a bitch considering he has ah, unblockable moves. Whenever an enemy shines gold like that, their move is unblockable. 
and you will have to either interrupt him or offensive defensive him <laughs> yeah I, I very rarely ah, I very rarely get no damage hits on these guys now whoa All right, that, okay I don't know what I just did there, but that wasn't quite what I wanted to do. I'm going to get rid of you, though, because you're going to be annoying otherwise. Plus, you can heal me real quick. There we go. Nice. Okay. So, now it's just me and you. Bud. Buddy, old pal, old friend of mine. Oh, wait, except there's two of them. <laughs> oh, fun times. But I can take off their body parts. Oh, hey. Oh, there we go. Got myself an opportunity to attack. Oh, God, what's happening? I don't know. The other hammer guy decided to get in the way and things are glitching out slightly. I expect nothing less. Ow! That wasn't offensive defensive, I think. I guess I can't do charge attacks. Like a running Y attack, or else he just... He seems to keep doing these special moves afterwards. There we go. That fight went a little better than the first, anyway. Whoa, what is happening with that? I don't know. It's so weird. Well, he's split into three pieces now. Or ten parts, as it says. Probably because of the way I cut him. Either way, that fight went... Meh. Could have gone better. There we go. A rank. That's not too bad. And up here should be another guy with a helicopter. But if you play your cards right... You can actually skip a fight around here. I don't remember how I used to do it, though. Because, you know, you can't see me for some reason. There you go! <laughs> and because of that, I missed out on a uh, moment to strike, I guess. No, he's fading away. But yeah, that would have been another fight with a helicopter, which is over there, actually. Ha! Huh. Didn't know that was there. I wonder if I aggro him, will he come over here and I'll get to do the fight anyway? That'd be interesting to find out. Now, originally, I wanted to show off something you could do in this area that used to be the speedrun tactic, but it's not anymore. Now, there is a there is a guy over there you can save. Um, I've only ever seen one person save him. And I really can't be bothered to do that right now, so I'm just going to fire that and blow him up. Because, you know, why not, essentially. Um, I don't know. I think there's a way we can save that guy if we try. But I wouldn't be able to try my other thing if I want to do that. Uh, red Phosphorus Grenade. Because this stuff, the Red Phosphorus, basically makes it so they can't fucking see you at all. And it's pretty amazing. Who's there? It is I, Raiden, the ninja of the night. Oh, I meant to take your arm. Okay, well that's not. No, no, stop. Be no, you see, this is the problem when it comes to slicing up people. Okay, is that Raiden insists he wants to take, he wants to cut and take, and he insists, but we cannot always have this. Okay, seriously, what is going on with these mid-air cuts right now? Things are shifting around. I don't know what's going on. I didn't even get my arm. You see, this is just a bad day right now. You stop that. All right, fine. I'm not going to do it. Just because just this guy's annoying me. And I didn't have the right weapon equipped anyway. So never mind. I had to make a choice there whether to try and save the guy or to do the trick. And I decided to try and save the guy, and because that failed, I couldn't really do the trick anymore, so... Whatever. It would have been cool, but I've never really successfully done it, so I was only going to try it a few times anyway. Would have been nice to have uh, got it right, though. You cannot proceed any further via the rooftops. There is a freight railroad underground. The elevator ahead will take you to it. Okay. So let us uh, head on inside. Up, uh, up. Oh man, how am I? I? Need to try and get in, I suppose, to press the button. I don't know how one gets in, so I'm gonna just cut this way. Wee! 
<laughs> oh my god. This must be the railroad. It would appear so. Likely part of Denver's old system. This city was a major transport hub in the early years of freight trains. This particular line appears to have been abandoned some time ago. It was originally constructed to transport supplies to an underground factory. But now, it seems even the electrical system is no longer functioning. Yeah, it's pitch black in here. As a cyborg, I trust this is not a serious concern. It is not. We can actually equip our VR mode and see everything, so that's quite nice. Or you can play it in pitch black. I know a lot of people do, because when you use your ninja run, your lightning basically lights up the area. So that's pretty useful. And you have this kind of after image effect that you can get. Oh, uh, was it your lightning or maybe when you attack? Could be when you attack, actually. I don't remember. One of them lights you up. I don't remember which one it is. I don't think it's either. I think I'm just telling shit right now. I don't know what's going on. I'm pretty sure one of them did, but I might be wrong. <laughs> So we're going to try and stealth this area. It might not work, considering I am terrible at stealthing in this game. But hey, we are going to see what we can do. I want this iron box. Could be sound good. Or it could be I just miss it every single time. What is it today? For some reason, everything is not happening. It's not clicking today. Seriously. What is going on? I don't even know. All right. So we've got black crocodiles in here again. Which is a bit frustrating, but you know what? Fuck you. Woo! Ah, oh, he noticed me. What? I know he was looking right at me, but still. Okay, yeah. So it's during combat against enemies, I guess, is when you uh, is when it actually shows up, so you can actually see what's going on. Considering you can't use the Oh! The little, uh... Mode that I, I'm trying to words right now when I'm fighting. It's not a good idea. Basically, you can't use your little... Detective mode while in a battle, so... They make it so it lights up when you're actually fighting something, which is nice. Can I just slice you two? Yeah, fuck you. That's what you get. You don't even get a special... A, B combination attack, you just die in a regular, normal ass fashion. Okay, so that wasn't complete stealth. I might still be able to get away with stealth killing some of these other things though. So, we're gonna try and do that. We'll try and do that with this guy right now. Hey, what? Ah, oh, no way! Fuck you. Seriously? Ugh. I told you, this game, this game does not want me to stealth. It just wants me to combat full-on combat all the time which I don't I don't mind I like the combat in this game so that's nice but still it would have been nice to have had some success when it comes to stealthing this area I can't remember what the speedrunners do I don't know if they just run through this and not even give a shit about the enemies so you get what Okay, 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 okay! <laughs> Fucking whatever! Ah. I want this. What is that? I don't even know. Homing missile! Yeah! Everything's better now because homing missiles. What? Oh, right. Mini geckos. I forgot about these guys. I, I think fully stealthing it is kind of difficult when it comes to those guys. I don't remember if they just notice you anyway. Um, it doesn't alert anyone or do anything. It's just annoying. All right, there we go. And the other one's me now. Oh, mini geckos! I don't know how you would deal with those guys without being noticed. That's the only thing. I don't think there is a way to do that. All right, there's another guy over there. We can try and sneak around him. I there guess. There is a maintenance shaft up ahead. Use it to return to the surface. Okay. For the time being, I'm going to try and do what I've been failing to do the last few times. Stab you in the butt! 
And then I'll slice you. This is revenge for me not being able to slice the other guy. Okay. And then there should be one near the door, yeah. Oh. He is just a red thing now. I don't know what happened to him. I see a rocket over there, but we're going to come back to that in a moment. Because I just want to stab this guy in the butt. Oh, right! Mini geckos! Ah, oh, shit. Well. I completely forgot about those guys. Yeah, if the mini geckos see you, then, uh, then the big guy sees you. Because that's the way that works. Probably because he alerted him. No. You're not allowed to grabby me. No grabby hands. What have I told you? No grabby hands. No grabby hands. You're not allowed to do that. It's against the rules. I'm just flinging around this guy and even killing mini geckos is like, oh my god, what is happening? You know what? I'm just gonna you can just die. I'm not even gonna try and Zundatsu you. Zundatsu you. <laughs> I didn't even mean for that to come out like that. That kind of works. I'll Zundatsu you. Alright, go away, Combat Rack. I don't care. I want to actually see what I'm doing. So, now that we've done that, we can collect everything else around here. Is this just a normal item box? Yes, it is. With a repair nano paste. Oh, yeah. And over here, you'll notice that uh, we have a very, very similar situation that we had last time. One sec. Let's see if he's, uh, if he's there. There he is. Oh, it is the ninja tripods again. I don't get why they are here, but here they are anyway. We must show them respect. In the dark. Woo! -woo! Straight down the middle. <laughs> Having way too much fun doing that with those guys. Alright. Another drum can. Activate the terminal. Okay. You don't have to tell me. Jeez, I know. Electrolyte pack. Actually, yeah, why haven't I been using the VR mode to know what the little uh, things are? Because then I'll be able to know whether I can use one or not. I don't know why I didn't think about that. I'm sorry, guys. I'm an idiot. Alright, jeez. Expect so much of me, or you expect nothing of me. Right. <laughs> it would appear your only way forward is to return to the surface. You will exit into an evacuated commercial district. Security is heavy, but you need not worry about collateral damage when engaging the enemy. About time. Finally, I can cut loose. Proceed to the right from the exit. You will find a stairway on your right. Those stairs lead to a shortcut to World Marshal Headquarters. Do not be distracted by the advertisements. You are not here as a tourist. Sure. I'll just buy a quick souvenir or two for Rose and that'll be it. Raiden, we must hurry. Remind me to teach you about sarcasm sometime. I understand your attempts at humor. I simply do not find them entertaining. Wow, what a bitch. <laughs> 